I don't have sob stories like all of you. I could sit here and complain how our mom liked Zuko more than me, but I don't really care. My own mother thought I was a monster. She was right, of course, but it still hurt. Give him some space. Appa, it's me, Suki. I'm a friend. I want to help you. You're hurt. We can help you feel better. And we can help you find Aang. You're easy to find. It's really astounding my brother hasn't captured you yet. What do you want with us? Who are you? The Avatar's fangirls? Oh, I get it. Good one, Azula. If you're looking for the Avatar, you're out of luck. <sighs> I knew this was a waste of time. No Avatar, huh? Well, that's okay. Any friend of the Avatar is an enemy of mine. So colorful, it's making me nauseous. You're not prettier than we are. Afraid of fire, I see. That's good. You should be. Go, Appa! Fly away from here! You know fans just make flames stronger? Brother and my uncle have disgraced the Fire Lord and brought shame on all of us. You may have mixed feelings about attacking members of the royal family, I understand. But I assure you, if you hesitate, I will not hesitate to bring you down. Dismissed. Princess, I'm afraid the tides will not allow us to bring the ship into port before nightfall. I'm sorry, Captain, but I do not know much about the tides. Can you explain something to me? Of course, Your Highness. Do the Tides command this ship? Uh, I'm afraid I don't understand. You said the Tides would not allow us to bring the ship in. Do the Tides command this ship? No, Princess. And if I were to have you thrown overboard, would the Tides think twice about smashing you against the rocky shore? No, Princess. Well then, maybe you should worry less about the Tides, who've already made up their mind about killing you, and worry more about me. He's still mulling it over. I'll pull us in. We've got to find Sokka and Top!
only way is to let her go. I'm sorry, Katara. be you? Azula! It is so good to see you. Please, don't let me interrupt your... whatever it is you were doing. Tell me, what is the daughter of a nobleman doing here? Certainly our parents didn't send us to the Royal Fire Academy for girls to end up in places like this. I have a proposition for you. I'm hunting a traitor. You remember my old fuddy-duddy uncle, don't you? Oh, yeah. He was so funny. I would be honored if you would join me on my mission. Oh, I, uh, would love to. But the truth is, I'm really happy here. I mean, my aura has never been pinker. I'll take your word for it. Well, I wouldn't want you to give up the life you love just to please me. Thank you, Azula. Of course, before I leave, I'm going to catch your show. <gasps> uh, yeah, sure, uh, of course. We're deeply honored to have the Fire Lord's daughter at our humble circus. Uh, tell us if there's anything we can do to make the show more enjoyable. I will. Incredible. Do you think she'll fall? Of course not. Then wouldn't it make it more interesting if you remove the net? Uh, the thing is, the performers... You're right, you're right. That's been done. I know. Set the net on fire. Of course, princess. Brilliant. Just brilliant. Ooh, what kind of dangerous animals do you have? Well, our circus boasts the most exotic assortment of... Release them all! <laughs> what an exquisite performance. I can't wait to see how you'll top yourself tomorrow. I'm sorry, Azula, but unfortunately there won't be a show tomorrow. Really? The universe has given me strong hints that it's time for a career change. I want to join you on your mission. <gasps> Uncle! Get up! <gasps> I thought you guys could use a little help. Thanks. Well, look at this. Enemies and traitors, all working together. I'm done. I know when I'm beaten. You got me. A princess surrenders with honor. Get 
away from us! Am I holding? A cherry pit, princess. Correct. And what day is this? It is the day of your coronation. Yes, it is. So please, tell me why on the most important day of my life you've decided to leave a pit in my cherry? It wasn't a decision. It was just a small mistake. Small? Do you realize what could have happened if I hadn't sensed the pit in time? I suppose you could have choked? Yes. Then you understand the severity of your crime. I understand, Princess. Please, forgive me. Oh, very well. Since it is a special day, I will show mercy. You are banished. Leave this palace immediately. What are you all looking at? I have two feet that need scrubbing. And make sure you get in between the toes. I won't have my first day as Fire Lord marred by poor foot hygiene.